this video goes with the other one but unfortunately my phone died this is a picture from an original 1611 King James Bible and here it says the gospel according to S. St. Matthew there's no change people once again I tell you in the name of Jesus Christ to trust God that's all trust God trust me either I'm saying trust God um, I just googled an original 1611 King James Bible I do know somebody who has one so um, I would love to have one myself the Acts of the Apostles that's another title chapter title not books that cat is changed she said is changed by quantum D-wave nefarious plots to usher in the Antichrist it's not true Lord Lord I say Lord God have mercy on the people I forgive them they know not what they do this is no change the Bible God's Word is eternal here we go again the first book of Moses this is from an original King James Bible and I hope you can make that out st. Mark they have it with an E claiming that the saint part is new and like my video last night which he claimed was a change it's the laminations of Jeremiah laminations of Jeremiah but if you go to the top it does says laminations and here's a t-shirt that has that page that Kat claimed can't quite make out all the symbols that she claimed meant all this um, Illuminati stuff boy oh boy I pray for that woman before she changes this one you can see it was called the Pistle of Paul now I say this is from an original King James Bible it is that publishers change things all the time and that's to keep up with the language changes look how they spelt new can you see that there N E W E the New Testament they spelt there's another thing she claimed was the answer it was the epistle the epistle to the prince she claimed was an insert that they were putting uh, the uh, queen and king and all the royals in there as to usher in the Antichrist it's always been there I remember that here we have the New Testament with the E on the end it's all publishing changes people